Hi, welcome back to Shootles with Google. Today, we have a special guest. So we have Shade Wall, the founder and principal investigator of Dominica's firmware project. What does the project do? So the Dominica's firmware project, uh, I started in 2005, and we wanted to know what it was like to be a sperm whale and live out in a family in the deep ocean. So we do a lot of science uh, about uh, how sperm whales live, how they talk to each other, how to protect them, and how to protect them. Uh, we put out these amazing tags called D tags. They were built by engineers who are now at the University of St. Andrews, which is in Scotland. And uh, they're about the size of a new iPhone, but a little bit thicker. And they go on with suction cups. We have a really, really long hole, and we come up behind the whales really slowly because we don't want to scare them. And we tap the tag on with the suction cups. And the tag measures the 3D movement of the whale. So when it dies, the tag goes down, and when the animal comes up, the tag comes back up. And it also records sound with two microphones, two underwater high yeah. And it's important for us that the tags only go on as suction cups, right? So we're not puncturing the animals. We're just measuring what they're doing for up to two days. Uh, and then the computer inside the tag can tell the suction cups to let go at any time of day. And then it's like, oh, it feels so physical. That's right. And then we find them because they have a beacon that uses radio signals. And we can listen to those radio signals and find, you know, a tiny little uh, tag in a giant boat. So in sperm whales, we call them units. And we've spent... Uh, the last 15 years with about 25 different families. And we've come to know some of them really, really, really well. Like Sophocles, who makes up our logo. Is there any special like, news about Sophocles? Yeah, well, Sophocles just had a baby a couple years ago. A calf, yeah. And it's a girl, and her name is Jonah. Um, they've shown us what it's like to dive as a baby when you're only one years old. As many people know, Sperm whales are like some of the best free divers on the planet. What we found out is that babies can make really deep dives like their mom. So their moms are diving to six or eight hundred meters to feed on squid. Uh, yeah, but they can dive almost to two thousand meters, two kilometers. Um, and the babies can do it too, but they don't do it most of the time. Because when mom makes a deep dive, there's another female at the surface to babysit the yeah. babies, right? Uh, and that's how they pick up their natal language and learn a bunch of different things. Yeah. So the overarching goal of our projects in Dominica, but wider around the world, is that we can learn from these animals, from the science that we do, in order to protect them better. You know, right now we treat all sperm whales in the world as the same, but we're starting to learn that they have these different <laughs> dialects, these different cultures, and we think that that's a really important part of protecting them. Well, I think uh, every nine-year-old kid wants to be a marine biologist for a little bit of their life, and uh, I think I'm just that nine-year-old kid. My favorite like animal when I was little was a killer whale, and uh, yeah, they're amazing, and uh, I, I just never gave up on that dream. So our project is supported by a lot of government research grants from science from Canada and from the country of Denmark. But also the, the really important supporter for us is to be the National Geographic Society. I'm a National Geographic Explorer. That means that we get to do all these amazing engagement activities with amazing people like you. And I think people like yourself are the future of exploration. So how could people on YouTube and donate to Well, if they want to learn about sperm whales or about the project or about me, uh, or even make a donation, they can go to our website, which is thespermwhaleproject.org. And they can download food. And they can meet all the whale families there by downloading our food. Yeah. yeah we're just making a 2019 update right now. See you in the big blue.